Hey besties, welcome and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jada Simone. Are you watching Jada's channel? I don't love just anyone. I am not just anyone. I rock heels, I rock Jordans. And I wear wigs and rock my natural. Can you believe it says I'm pretty for a dark skin? Hey besties, so long time no sit down video. <laughs> It's been a long time since I did an actual like sit down content video, but it is officially fall. It is what I think it's like November. It's November 6th. It's officially daylight savings time. And I wanted to come on here and show y'all the fragrances that I've been loving for this fall season. If you guys want to know what I've been smelling like, what I've been loving, what I've been obsessing over, because honestly, I think fall fragrances might be my favorite. I don't know maybe because fall is my favorite season y'all know my birthday is in fall my birthday just passed so shout out to me but i don't know like i want y'all to know what i've been smelling like and hopefully y'all can go out and get these fragrances as well because they are definitely on sale a lot of them are on sale right now for the savora holiday savings event so if you are a rouge member you will get these for 20 percent off and a lot of them did come in little gift sets so if you guys want to know what i've been smelling like this fall keep on watching so the first fragrance is this dolce and Gabbana the only one and when I tell y'all you are only going to want to wear this for a special occasion she is very very warm very very sweet like sweet sweeter than sweet but I love it I would wear this to like a black tie event or someone's birthday where you, everybody has to like dress up and look nice sexy and sophisticated like this is definitely a special occasion scent she's that girl so the top notes of this fragrance are violet orange and bergamot the middle notes are coffee pear iris orange blossom and rose and the base notes are caramel vanilla and patchouli and y'all already know why I like this scent it's the patchouli in it makes it warm sexy seductive but also the coffee note is what makes it different and smells super duper edible along with the caramel that's what makes it super duper sweet like when i tell y'all this scent is very intoxicating when you are wearing the scent and you walk past anybody they are going to smell it and they're going to ask you what you're wearing and you're going to tell them what it is and tell them that jada sent you so the next fragrance y'all already know is my all-time favorite for the full time killian princess I love this fragrance so much. I have another one of the fragrances from this collection after the sunset, but she is top tier. Low key, she might be top two of my favorite fragrances. I'm in love with this fragrance. She's just that girl. She's just very sweet, very warm. I honestly would wear this anytime. I do try to save it for like special occasions because I don't want it to run out and then I'll have to purchase a new one. But I wear this to work. I wear this for date night. I wear this all the time. I love this fragrance. I bought this fragrance with me on vacation during the freaking summer and springtime. That's how much I love this scent. But I do definitely feel like it's definitely a fall scent because it is so warm and cozy. It gives like vanilla marshmallow by the fireside cozy vibes. So the top note is lemon. The middle notes are green tea, ginger, peach, hedian, jasmine and apple and the base notes are marshmallow vanilla and benzoin and that marshmallow that marshmallow y'all like the marshmallow just makes a lasting impression the marshmallow is what makes the scent is what makes her her is what makes her a princess like it's the marshmallow so the next fragrance i have is ysl libre now she is for my grown and sexy sophisticated boss besties y'all this is another one that I try to only wear on special occasions like if I'm going to like a dinner party or out on a date night or something of that nature. I wore this to work one time and it was just too intoxicating like too too much and i never say that about any of my fragrances but i definitely feel like there's a place and a time for all of my fragrances so work definitely was not her time maybe when i become a boss chick ceo then it'll be her time but right now i'm just an assistant buyer so it's not her time yet it's not her time but i do love her she smells so rich 
so rich so sophisticated so sexy she literally smells like money so the top notes are lavender mandarin orange black currant and pettigrain the middle notes are lavender again orange blossom and jasmine and the base notes are madagascar vanilla musk cedar and amber y'all this is definitely a very warm floral and i just love it i'm literally obsessed with this scent for the full time definitely a go-to girls night scent you going out to the club or out to eat with your girl Girls, I would definitely pop this scent on because everybody is definitely gonna ask you what you're wearing now next is my Hermes Twilly Eau Pauvry and she is not everybody's cup of tea but she is definitely my cup of tea I like my tea nice and warm and she gives just that I love this scent and if you guys can't tell by now and like all the mini fragrance videos that I've done I have a very versatile very wide range fragrance collection there's something in my collection for every single bestie out there and she you know a select few besties might not like her but I love her like this scent so warm so spicy like this is probably my spiciest scent and I am obsessed with this scent I wore it when I went to the vineyard last year and I got so many compliments I try not to wear her she is very tiny I need to get the bigger size but I don't wear her as often because I in my head, I have to wear her doing fall activities, cute, grown fall activities is when she has to get worn. So the top note is pink pepper, the middle note is rose, and the base note is patchouli. And y'all already know, it's the patchouli. It's the patchouli. We will say this in every single video. It is the patchouli for me. But that pink pepper and that rose, it is a very, very, very spicy floral. And honestly, rose is one of my least favorite notes i don't know rose just i like the way roses smell i love roses but rose as a scent and fragrances it just i don't really care too much for it but in this scent oh it's intoxicating oh my goodness y'all like literally just that spice from the pink pepper and the patchouli i i want to put it on now but i'm going to bed after i finish filming so there's no reason for me to put this on but i want y'all to at least go to your nearest hermes store or Saks or wherever you can snag this and smell it like just smell it give it a chance it'll definitely be something more sophisticated more mature for your scent palette but i definitely feel like this scent is worth it so the next scent we have is the newest flower bomb and isn't she so freaking cute now the original flower bomb i don't really care too much for it i do have it i have it in the travel size it is too sweet and too powdery for me um i might throw it on here and there and i might try to layer it with something a little more warm to balance it out but when i tell y'all this is the perfect formula they knew exactly what they were doing with this fragrance Mm, it is like the perfect floral fruity gourmand and I love it honestly I feel like this is more so an everyday fragrance for the fall time I wear this during the day I wear this to work I wear this everywhere like she definitely stands out people are definitely going to smell you people are definitely going to turn their heads when you walk past them but she's definitely still appropriate for the daytime and she can go from day to night that's why i love her so much so the top notes are peach and vine the middle note is orchid and the base note is vanilla and honestly at first sniff you would think that this fragrance was full of like red fruity berry notes so that peach definitely surprises you but the peach is definitely what makes the fragrance what she is i don't know what they did with this fragrance but they did what they were supposed to do and lastly is my girl mark jacobs perfect intense y'all already know i love her i'm going to wear her every fall every winter i wear her sister every spring every summer they are literally it's in the name perfect they are literally the perfect scent i don't know what the heck mark jacobs did but he did what he needed to do with these scents so the top note is narcissist and night blooming jasmine the middle note is almond and the base note is sandalwood and those are four simple notes but they blend so perfectly and y'all oh my goodness it just oh my goodness if you have this on people are definitely no doubt about it are going to say oh my gosh what do you have on it's the perfect warm floral it's very fruity very ambery I just it's very 
loud but not loud headache loud it's very like i'm here statement it's not like too much perfume it's not like too loud to where it gives you a headache and makes you feel sick like no it's loud and the fact that it makes a statement and it says i'm here and i'm that girl and that's why i love this so much all right besties so that is all for today's video i hope you guys liked all the fragrance that i showed you guys today and if you are interested in any of these fragrances, make sure you head over to sephora.com or your nearest sephora store sephora definitely has all of these fragrances online but like i said i also got some of these last year and the years before and gift sets so if you can get a gift set that is your best value but if not again if you are a rouge member like i am you get 20 percent off your entire purchase and it's coming up on the holiday season get some perfumes for yourself but also get some perfumes for your loved ones put them on to fragrances and also put them on to my videos because y'all know i put y'all on so yeah thank y'all for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see y'all in the next one bye besties